And greetings everyone this is probably going to be a little shorter of a video um if you see my tudic collection over here uh alan tudic uh i have to fix i have to fix wash still that's that's on the list check me out on uh on saturdays and sundays i'll be doing some maybe possibly live streams but mostly just gonna be um uh videos with some 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 fixings so i got this and after looking at imdb and finding this at a store on clearance i picked up uh, this green arrow figure from mcfarlane it is uh i believe a target exclusive i've seen the 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 non all right so uh, put it this way I've seen the, the non-hatted, uh, I don't know what the correct terminology for that is. Oh look, I got a comic book I'll never read. Um, <laughs> this is from the Injustice game, and I've seen the, the one where he, he's just got his hair on there. Um, so I decided to get this one, because I like this one better. And this one was normally, I think, 20-some bucks, but on sale, I got it for like 10. So thanks Target for having really weird sales right now. Uh, if you go to your Target now, you might be too late. Um, but when I went, they had so much stuff on clearance, it was almost impossible to figure out what wasn't on clearance. Uh, ah, there. Get out of here. So, uh, Mr. Alan Tudick, uh, he, he voices the Green Arrow in uh, Injustice 2, maybe Injustice 1, I can't remember which one it is, but it's this outfit, so I, uh, I decided I'm going to go for it and get this one, because I like this look better than without the thing, it's, it's not the hood from a... Uh, the Arrow TV show. Well, that's a big, uh, it's a weird design they got there. But I figure now I got another, uh, another one to add to the pile of Alan Tudyk. Uh, if you follow me on Instagram, I will probably be posting this there as well. Uh, just as a fun little little john so so there he is and this is gonna be my next uh, tmnt video uh toka and razar showed up finally finally ah oh, the lack of thigh cuts on these kill me mm. he doesn't have the diaper though oh no he does kind of well, it's just the crotch piece but he's got the uh, the up here so hey i got a mcfarland figure without the uh, weird diaper thing going on there and these are actually pretty decent the huh it's actually an okay figure um all things said this is a little big i mean it's almost like he can fit double the amount of arrows that he needs to uh maybe that's so this can fit in there i don't know but it does come with the classic uh stand from McFarlane so I will be popping Ollie right there uh as I said please keep an eye out on my Saturday and Sunday videos uh, I will be doing some customs as well as some fixes since I had this guy that broke look at how tiny he is compute that's the one thing so like this figure looks fine with a the six inch scale but man, even McFarlane's are tall for, this is the, the Masterverse. And they're seven inch scale. So what's this eight? I don't know. It's crazy. It kind of bothers me because I wanted this to be kind of in scale, but uh, whatever. I just want to have a weird Alan Tudyk collection. So if you like this video, please like, subscribe, comment. Until next time, I'm Alpha Magnus. These are toys.